بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ان دس ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ٹاک اباؤٹ سم پراپرٹیز آف انہیلنٹ اینستھیٹکس دا مین پراپرٹیز آر ایم اے سی منیمم الویولر کنسنٹریشن دا پوٹینسی اینڈ دا سولیبلٹی آف دیز ڈرگس what does MAC means MAC means the amount of anesthesia necessary to prevent the patient prevent pain response to painful stimuli in 50% of patients so that that means that the minimum amount of anesthesia that is necessary to prevent the pain uh, pain response to the painful stimuli next we have is potency uh, potency means that the concentration of drug needed to produce the desired effect uh next we have is a solubility solubility means drugs ability to dissolve in the body solvents and the body solvents are basically the tissue and the blood so how these uh, uh things are related with each other uh you can see that uh potency is directly proportional to the solubility uh so if a drug is having high potency that means it will have high solubility but that is inversely relation uh, uh, inversely related to the percentage requirement of a drug that means that if a drug will have high potency and high solubility less drug will be needed to have the desired effect meanwhile if a drug is going to have low solubility low potency that means the, that drug will be needing more concentration or more requirement percentage requirement of that drug to have the desired effect next we have is the induction or recovery both uh, like a fast induction uh, solubility and potency are inversely proportional to the fast induction so if the solubility and potency are high or mainly you can say so if the solubility is high uh, the induction will be slow but if the solubility is low induction will be fast similarly uh, the relationship with mac is inversely proportional to uh, like potency and solubility so hence short you can say if a drug is less soluble uh, there will be increased percentage requirement or increase amount of drug is needed and there will be fast induction because the drug is less soluble so um, the commonly used drugs are basically desflurane sevoflurane and isoflurane uh, we can see uh, everything over uh, in this uh, green chart uh, sorry orange chart um, mac Uh, desflurane has highest mac then sevo and then isoflurane and then we have potency and we know potency and mac are inversely relation in inverse relationship so desflurane has least potency then sevo and then isoflurane and then comes solubility we know potency and solubility are directly proportional but mac and solubility are inversely proportional so desflurane then uh, is least uh, has least solubility then sevo and then iso isoflurane has maximum solubility then we know induction and recovery are inversely proportional to the solubility if a drug is more soluble uh, like uh, you can see uh, desflurane uh, is uh, least soluble but isoflurane is most soluble drug then isoflurane is the same drug that he has uh, least or like very slow induction and very slow recovery but if you see the desflurane uh, desflurane is least soluble that is why its induction and recovery is very fast because it is least soluble in the blood and tissues in the body so these were basically the properties uh, which uh, are kept under consideration while uh, choosing an anesthetic uh, drug uh, um, before surgery although there are other properties too like uh, the effects of these anesthetic gases on different systems of the body git respiratory renal we have to keep uh, those things in concentrate consideration too uh, but uh, the purpose of This lecture was to study these properties. I hope you have grasped a concept of that. Thank you so much.